My name is Tom from the Physics Classroom. In this video, I'm going to give you a quick introduction to the Physics Classroom website. I'm going to discuss Task Tracker and what a teacher can do with a Task Tracker subscription. And finally, I'm going to discuss some of the popular features of Task Tracker. Let's get started. This is a quick overview of the Physics Classroom website for those who are less familiar with it. At the Physics Classroom, we organize our resources according to type. So on the home page, you'll see a collection of links to types of resources. For instance, the Physics Classroom tutorial link heads to the section where we keep a lot of our written tutorials. And the video tutorial link leads to the section where we keep a lot of our video tutorials. And so on and so forth. Within each of these sections, you'll find topical areas. So in the Physics Classroom Tutorial section, you'll find a Kinematics Topic area, and inside of the Physics Video Tutorial section, you'll also find a Kinematics Topic area. So when you use the Physics Classroom, first think about what type of resource you're looking for. Then click on that link and delve into the topic for, to find that perfect resource for your classroom. Here's some details about the various resource types. The Physics Classroom Tutorial and Video Tutorial represent our efforts to help students learn physics with easy to understand tutorial pages and videos. The Physics Simulation section contains around 100 different simulations in which students manipulate a variable and observe the outcome. Nearly every simulation is accompanied by a student activity sheet. These activity sheets guide students towards a particular learning outcome. The Minds on Physics and Concept Builder sections consist of interactive questioning modules that help students reason towards an understanding of a physics concept. The Calculator Pad is an automated problem delivery and grading system that's pretty hard to beat. We have more than 2,000 physics and chemistry problems organized into more than 200 different short problem sets. You can even write your own problems if you have a Task Tracker account and customize the problem sets that we prepared for you. The Concept Checker sections is designed to be paired with a physics simulation. Each concept checker provides a student a quick check for understanding if they understood the concept behind the physics simulation and accompanying activity sheet. There's other resources here as well. For instance, the review session is popular among students preparing for quizzes and tests. The curriculum corner is popular among teachers who need that perfect think sheet for the upcoming lesson. And finally, the question bank is a great product that you can download and use to prepare quizzes and tests for your classes. So what is Task Tracker? Task Tracker is our tool for tracking student progress on website activities. With a Task Tracker subscription, you can create classes and populate those classes with students. You can then create assignments out of our website activities. You won't have to grade a thing. We'll do all the grading and scoring for you. You just check back later to view records of student progress. With a Task Tracker subscription, you can even customize certain tasks and create custom scoring rules. We'll use your scoring rules to determine scores for students as they do our website assignments. Task Tracker gives you control over how your students use our website. When you purchase a Task Tracker subscription, you're purchasing seats. Seats are like tickets that allow your students to use a website feature. We have five different features, so to use all five features, you would need five tickets or seats for each student. That would mean $5 per student. But in 2023, we're offering a buy two, get three free bundle. That is, if you buy two seats for your students to use two features, we'll throw in three features free. Sounds kind of catchy. Buy two, get three free in 2023. This special goes through the end of the subscription season that ends on July 31st, 2024. You can use the seat and cost calculator at our store to determine how many seats you need for your students. So what are these five task tracker features that I can use with my classes for the cost of two tickets or seats? Well, I'm glad you asked. First, there's concept builders. Concept Builders is our most popular Task Tracker feature. It's the one that's been around the longest in the Task Tracker world. Each Concept Builder targets a specific learning outcome and gives students a great exercise in conceptual reasoning and sense making. Minds on Physics has been around since 1999 and only recently added to the Task Tracker suite. A Minds on Physics mission provides a student great exercise and close reading critical thinking, and self-reflection. 
Every Minds on Physics mission is accompanied by a page of help that targets key understandings that a student needs to have in order to answer the question. The calculator pad was introduced last year in 2022 and is quickly becoming very popular, partly because of its great versatility. There is a range of difficulty levels for the problems and a range of problem types. For instance, you have your classic end-of-the-chapter type problems where students solve for an unknown, and then you have your more goalless problems, which are multi-part problems in which students must analyze a physical scenario. Adding to the interest in calculator pad is the fact that students can create their own problem sets and even write their own problems. The fourth feature is the physics interactives with concept checkers. The idea is that you would assign a physics simulation from our physics interactive section to students and you would provide them with one of our activity sheets. Students would work through the interactive towards a particular learning outcome and then you'd follow it up with a physics concept checker. Each concept checker is designed to be paired with a physics simulation in order to check for student understanding. Our latest addition to Task Tracker is the Science Reasoning Center. If you do NGSS, then you also want to do the Science Reasoning Center. And if you don't do NGSS, well, you probably still want to use the Science Reasoning Center. The Science Reasoning Center requires that students combine an understanding of a physics concept with a science and engineering practice and an overarching science idea in order to analyze a scenario-based story about a physics phenomenon. It's brand new. Come check it out. There's one last thing to note. If your budget does not permit the purchase of two seats per student to use all five features, here's a suggestion. Purchase one seat per student to use one feature, a feature like concept builders or calculator pad, and receive full customization and progress tracking on that feature. And for the other four features, try the free version. You won't be able to track student progress or customize the assignment, and students won't be able to save their progress when they're halfway through it, but it still makes great student practice for in-class and out-of-class work. If you have any questions, you can leave them in the comment section here, or you can find my email address at the bottom of the About page on the website.